BTBT stock, NXTP stock, and RESN stock. These are some of the mini stocks that were very active in this session of the 6th of October 2021. And Beat Digital Inc., or rather Beat, or BTBT stock, gained as much as 14% in this session. And the company announced that it had closed an $80 million private placement deal with an institutional investor. And it sold $13.5 million, or rather 13.5 million shares plus warrants for the purchase of 10.1 million shares at a, combi at a combined price of $5.93. That news came out yesterday, the 5th of um, October. And it just closed at $11.215, again of 8.36. 89.9 million shares crossed the tape, it was, which was above average. Momentum for BTBT is strongly bullish. The 40 Peter Sluice Classic Escalator is rising as investors pay high prices for BTBT stock. Today's volume was heavier than usual, trading 89.917 million shares versus an average of 8.515 shares per day during the last 12 months. The unbalanced volume indicator is bullish. The slope of the indicator is positive and suggests that buyers are presently more active than sellers. Those buyers have taken control of BTBT BT stock, suggesting the consolidation and retracement may have come to an end for now, especially since this price action was achieved on higher than above average volume. Also, the 14 Peter Sluice Classic Escalator shows that neither the K line, the fast line, nor the D line, the slow line, are oversold, indicating strength. In addition, that same or those two lines, or rather the first line, the, which is the which is the K line, has crossed uh, the D line, which is another bullish sign. So, moving on to NXTP, NXT, NXTP stock, Next Play Technologies Inc. It closed the session of the sixth of October, twenty twenty one, at one point seven dollars, a gain of twenty nine point seven seven percent on a volume of three point eight million shares, which is above average as well. It, uh, NXTP appears to be rallying within a longer term bearish trend, driving its MACD above the signal line. However, the shares remain below a declining 200 day moving average, signifying that the dominant trend remains lower. It's also lagging the SP 500. Momentum for NXTP is strongly bullish. The 14 Peter Slusic Escalator is rising as investors pay high prices for NXTP shares. Today's volume was heavier than usual. Uh, trading 3.795 million shares versus an average of 446,594 shares per day during the last 12 months. The unbalanced one indicator is bullish. The stop of the indicator is positive and suggests that buyers are presently more active than sellers. This rally has placed uh, the stock above its 10 day moving average and as well as the 20 day moving average on above average volume. It's still too early to call uh, NXTP stock a buy, though some, uh, though some technical by though by some technical measure that may be the case. Just just be really cautious with that one. RE RESN stock, Resonant Inc., a provider of radio frequency filter solutions, developed a robust intellectual property platform designed to connect people and things has expanded its multi-year commercial partnership with uh, Morata Manufacturing Co. Limited, the world's largest RF filter manufacturer for the development of 5G X-Bar RF filters. The expanded agreement targets filter designs utilizing resonance proprietary X-Bar technology across additional bands. Uh, so RESN stock appeared, appeared to be consolidating within a longer term uptrend. The average directional index is below 20, indicating that the shares have traded sideways recently. However, the 200-day moving average is still sloping bullishly upwards, and it is uh, lagging the S&P 500. Momentum for RESN stock is strongly bullish. The 14 Peter Slow Stochastic Escalator is rising as investors pay high prices for RESN stock. Today's volume was heavier than usual, trading 5.243 million shares versus an average of 1.404 million shares per day during the last 12 months. The unbalanced volume indicator is bearish, the sub of indicator is negative. 
I suggest that there is a lack of buying interest. The 40 period slow stochastic oscillator of RESN stock shows that the uh, the K line, the fast line, and the D line, the slow line, are oversold, indicating weakness. So uh, that um, unbalanced on bottom indicator is um, um, yes, yeah, still uh, indicating this that there is some weakness, and indeed uh, the the um, 14 period slow stochastic oscillator following the uh, lines, the fast and the slow lines. So. Yeah, the fast line has crossed the slow line, even though they are still oversold, but the fast line has cro crossed the slow line, uh, which is a bullish sign, but caution is still warranted if you want to get involved with um, RESN stock. So thank you very much for watching this video.